Hi everybody, my name is Melissa Henderson. I currently do not work for an agency or department. However, in the past, I have worked for the Webster County Sheriff's Department as a 911 dispatcher, booking officer, and jailer, and for the Nixa Police Department as a 911 dispatcher. Both of these agencies were relatively small. I don't know the current size of these departments. However, I do know that the size of the Webster County Sheriff's Office has increased substantially with the addition of their new jail. As a 911 dispatcher, I probably use strategic planning multiple times a day on nearly every call I receive. It was part of my job to prioritize those calls and focus my resources such as law enforcement, fire and rescue, and ambulance personnel accordingly. Over the years, I have also owned a number of businesses. Strategic planning is imperative if any business is to be successful. With all that being said, you may be wondering what I'm doing in this course. I originally planned to attend the police academy and obtain my degree in criminal justice. However, in 2003, I was diagnosed with systemic lupus and fibromyalgia. A few years later, in 2006, just after beginning my college career, I ruptured a disc in my spine in an accident. A fragment of that disc pierced my spinal cord, requiring emergency surgery. The accident left me unable to feel anything from my waist down. Luckily, however, I was able to regain nearly full function of my legs in about six months. But I was in terrible pain. My career suffered for many years after that due to multiple back surgeries and dependence on pain medication. But in 2016, I gave in to my surgeon's recommendation of having one last surgery, a spinal fusion. This was one of the best decisions that I have ever made. After I recovered from that surgery, I picked up where I left off in my college career. And I haven't really looked back since. I realized that my dream of becoming a police officer just was not going to happen and that need and that I needed a career that didn't involve physical altercations. I obtained an associate's degree in criminal justice and an associate's degree in behavioral health, behavioral science from OTC as well as my bachelor of science degree in criminal justice from Drury. I plan to begin law school in fall of 2022. In the meantime, I'm pursuing my graduate degree in public service and safety leadership and studying for the LSAT.